So the two abandoned Sleeping Beauties behind me, we got the Hotel Eddystone and Hotel Park Avenue. They were built in 1924 when Park Avenue was going to be something of a Fifth Avenue in New York, right? We were going to have a bunch of hotels, shops, upscale residential, because as downtown grew around the 1920s, the, that upscale, uh, well-to-do residents of Detroit started moving north on Woodward. So both of these hotels, you know, when we talk about hotels today, we think of, I'm in town for a night, I need a place to crash. Well, back in the 1920s, we had a lot of transients, um, people who would come to Detroit to, to work in the factories would actually live in these hotels. So they're like residential hotels, basically. Um, as Detroit's fortunes changed from, you know, the prosperous to the less so, uh, like many buildings in Detroit, these two fell abandoned and run down. They spent a little bit of time in the 1950s, uh, the Salvation Army ran the Park Avenue as the uh, Eventide Senior Living Facility, so it was basically a giant <laughs> retirement home. So, you know, this is an area that is seeing a tremendous amount of change. And I think that once that hockey arena comes in, you're gonna see a lot of this stuff start growing. But what it will be, I don't know. You know, I think only time will tell.